Hello everyone. In today's video, we will see the striking analogies between Vedanta philosophy and modern science. We will see how this ancient Indian tradition offers a worldview that resonates with the latest scientific discoveries, opening up new perspectives on our reality. But before we dive into this, let me introduce myself. I'm Brian, a 60-year-old British man with an insatiable curiosity for the world. This voice you hear is not my own, but that of an AI, an artificial intellect with which I endeavor to unravel many existential questions that have been my lifelong companions. Like many of you, I am fascinated by the mysteries of the universe, the human mind, and our place in this grand cosmic scheme. If you are a seeker like me, please subscribe to the channel. Thank you. Vedanta philosophy and modern science, despite coming from different cultural and historical backgrounds, share a common aspiration, the search for truth. Both disciplines rely on observation, analysis, and rationality to unlock the secrets of the universe. Diving deeper into the intriguing parallels, let's focus on the concept of a holographic universe, a theory which continues to captivate the scientific community. This groundbreaking idea was proposed by the esteemed theoretical physicist Gerard de Hooft. He suggests an alternative perspective on reality, one that likens it to a holographic projection, much like a three-dimensional hologram that is generated from two-dimensional information. To simplify Gerard de Hooft's theory, imagine a hologram. It appears three-dimensional, but its essence is stored on a two-dimensional surface, the holographic plate. Gerard de Hooft proposed that our universe is similar. It appears three-dimensional to us, but in essence it can be encoded on a two-dimensional surface. His theory goes on to argue that every bit of information we perceive in three dimensions can be explained as a projection from this two-dimensional reality. Interestingly, this aligns wonderfully with the ancient spiritual philosophy of Vedanta and its concept of Maya or illusion. Vedanta posits that the reality we experience is just a facade, a veil that hides the true nature of consciousness. This veil of illusion is what makes our universe appear as three-dimensional, when it could, in fact, be two-dimensional. Exploring the idea that the information of the entire universe is in a two-dimensional surface further, it is proposed that, much like how a flat piece of holographic film can contain a three-dimensional image, the flat universe can contain all the information necessary to project our perception of a three-dimensional reality. In essence, the holographic universe theory proposes an intriguing model of cosmos, one where all the complexities of our universe, from galaxies to atoms, are holographic projections from a two-dimensional surface. It's a captivating theory that intertwines modern physics with ancient spiritual philosophy, changing how we comprehend our reality. Going further with the analogies both Vedanta and modern science are converging towards the idea that consciousness is the fundamental principle of the universe. Quantum physics, with its subject-observer theory, implies that consciousness can influence reality itself. Vedanta affirms that reality is Brahman, the universal consciousness, of which we are all an integral part. The subject-observer theory was formulated by Werner Heisenberg, one of the fathers of quantum physics. According to this theory, the act of observation influences the outcome of an experiment. In other words, the observer's consciousness is an integral part of reality. Heisenberg argued that reality is not an object independent of the observer, but is a co-creation between the observer and the observed. The observer is not a passive observer, but actively participates in the creation of reality. Several scientific studies are exploring the relationship between mind and matter. A 2020 study, published in the journal Nature Human Behavior, showed that meditation can increase the activation of brain areas associated with awareness and self-consciousness. The analogies between Vedanta and modern science are profound and suggestive. Both disciplines invite us to look beyond appearances and explore the fundamental nature of reality. In this cosmic dance between science and spirituality, we can find a broader vision of ourselves and our place in the universe. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and please consider subscribing to the channel.